Hi, my name is Steve Faulkner. Welcome to Real Magic Review, and this is Untrammeled by the Wonder House and TCC. Before we do this, can you please like and subscribe if you like it, share it if you really, really like it, um, and that might be important for this one too, which I'll talk about in a minute, and check out onlinemagic.co. That's my online magic course of either over 500 videos, live sessions uploaded every week, guest lecturers, uh, all for $9.99 a month. You get hours of footage every month for that too. And of course, you get to join in the live sessions as well, where we just hang out, talk, and get, as I say, guests in and and it's a very, very cool community. So be part of something cool. I've had to do this quite quickly because I was put back by COVID and I did promise um, TCC and Wonder House that I would get this out because it's a Kickstarter campaign. Now at the time of recording, there's only a few days left of this. So please do me a favor um, for my karma basically is after this, go and check out the Kickstarter, have a look at it, read the details because I'm not gonna get all the details in here because uh, like I said, I've, uh, I'm, I'm trying to get this out before the Kickstarter finishes. The point of the Kickstarter is to keep the price down and keep the quality up. So I think we should support people to do that and try and get these, these things out like this that are quality products and classics. And as you know, I am a classicist. Uh, a classicist. He's really easy for me to say with a lift. Um, I did drink a water after that. So what this is, is it's a quality, beautifully made, absolutely beautifully packaged, beautifully made ball and vase. You know, we've all seen this as kids and that's why it's lovely. Now, I remember hearing years ago, there was a Harry Riser routine with a cone and ball and vase. And I've always fascinated with this idea of taking these things like the Lincoln Rings, where some people will know how it's done and creating real magic with them and almost using that in a way. Now, the point of this, well, a couple of points are, first one is, as I said, it's amazingly made. It's really solid. It's really beautiful. There's a little unboxing video that I will show now. So this is lovely. Um, and I, I think it does show the care that TCC put into the stuff. I don't want to break this seal. So I'm, I've opened it at the side. Um, and here you've got a really nicely presented kind of graphic of how the, the thing's put together. Um, it's all very lovely. I'm not going to show you all this because I think it'll, um, it'll ruin it. But uh, ball and vase or vase, depending on where you come from. Classic magic trick of all time. Even since it was first documented, it has crossed a history of 346 years. You have to un update that, aren't they? Every year. Uh, the presentation itself is, I should have rounded it up. Uh, the presentation itself is an integration of various effects, including vanish, appearance, transposition, color changing, transformation. There's no need to worry about the mechanics, just focus on the performance. It's as pure and magical as it gets. Um, we drew the untrammeled. Uh, is that, it sounds wrong. Untrammeled. Untrammeled. It is. I did check it. And you're going to hear some shocking uh, pronunciations. I've also checked these, but I'm not sure. We drew the inspiration from the three pools mirroring the moon, which is one of the ten scenes of Westlake, China. Lake light and autumn moonlight in harmony. The calm surface of Westlake is an unpolished metal mirror. The lake reflects the grace of the moon. Is the moon real or is it an illusion? So it's nice that they've drawn inspiration from this. And it is very poetic and lovely, and I'm a bit of a sucker uh, for all that kind of stuff. But I just wanted to let you know what you get. Basically, you get a nice, a nice little presentation of the gimmick itself, the prop itself. Uh, in this beautiful, present, beautifully presented uh, envelope, and I don't want to break. I don't want to break that as well. So I'm, I can't bear it. I can't. I'm one of those sort of people that if my kid give me a present, I keep the wrapping paper and stuff like that. So this, oh look, it's it's beautiful. Oh look, I'm glad I haven't had to knacker that up because I can put that. That so there it is, uh, and I haven't opened this yet. This isn't like set up. It's really, really lovely, um, and and then you've got this really rustic kind of uh, presentation of the well, untrammeled. Is that what they're saying? It still sounds wrong. It sounds like it should sound more poetic. Uh, oops. Yeah, and just really. Really lovely. That was the wrong angle, wasn't it? There. 
And these are actually interesting. These are small enough to vanish quite well. Um, I know we've got a kind of wrong angle-ish on that, but but they feel yeah, they're not too big. So anybody that's kind of working on their ball vanishes, it does feel a little bit more like a. Co I'm looking at them. That's why I'm looking at. I should be looking at them. I'm looking at the monitor. Um, but it, it does feel like a sort of coin vanish rather than you know sometimes you've got big things to vanish like multiplying balls and that's a whole different thing. This this is going to be fine. These are these are a little bit bigger than the balls I use for cups and balls, um, and and there. Very lovely to handle. I'm not going to expose the gimmick here, but I just wanted to show you um, what you get there because some things are worthy of unboxing. And I'm very thankful that that this download is um, 21 minutes. Brilliant. That's what you want, isn't it? 21 minute download. Looks great. Well lit. Well mic'd. Um, and I'm going to get into this now, uh, but all I'll see, I mean, I'll just, if I just sort of go on to, yeah, I mean, it's just, it's just clear, um, talks you for everything, and uh, I'm happy. So I haven't got a three hour download to watch. Uh, so that's a good thing too. And that would have given you uh, quite a lot of uh, information, but importantly, it's taken a thing and making it very magical. This is magical. You'll be doing magic with this at people, you will fool people. And I know this because I watched the tutorial after, you know, when I, when I got up on the computer back in the other film, uh, and he fooled me. <laughs> so, so you've got to get this idea that it's the thing we, a posh version of a thing we get in magic kits. It's not. What it is, is it's the trick that we got in our magic kits that is as old as eels, like I said, 300 odd years old made to be really deceptive, not use that same way that everybody knows it's used, so we use that and create real magic with it. At its most basic, and very basic, I mean this is as basic as it gets, no sleight of hand at all, you put a ball away, so uh, as you'd have done this with kids, but again look how much more deceptive this is, you show that there is no ball left, you click your fingers, magic wand, etc, etc, and then you show that there is a ball back, and then you click again, you show the ball has vanished and you get the ball out of your pocket at its most basic. Now, you're, that's not the routine you're going to be doing with this because there are other things uh, incorporating this beautiful uh, sort of crystal ball thing, which isn't that beautiful at the moment. It's fine, um, but it's unexpected. And he fooled me with it. It was brilliant. And he does this lovely thing where he gets a torch out, puts it under there and it shines stars onto the ceiling as well. So really, really magical stuff. A lot of thought gone into it, a lot of design and a lot of work. Uh, like I said, it's, it's made out of this kind of African hardwood that's going to last you forever and looks really, really beautiful. And I can't say a negative thing about it, actually. If you like this sort of thing, you're going to be very, very happy with the, how this gimmick's made and, uh, and pretty much everything about it. I'm not affiliated. I just, you know, credit where credit's due. Um, and this is the uh, Untrammeled, which is the classic ball and vase or vase, as I said, uh, depending away from. And check out the link below in the next as soon as you can please would be great to go through and have a look at the kickstarter campaign and then you know after playing with it and you asking me questions i'll talk about it on the live sessions so thank you to tcc for sending that to me i'm so sorry it took me so long to get to um but hopefully this will help and like and subscribe check out onlinemagic.co and uh, and i think you'll really enjoy this I, i've been playing with it and kind of improvising with it and it, there's a lot you can do with it so much more than you think